this is just a really quick video to show how to do a cooling mod for the heads of these four valve engines. Um, mainly the Cobras from 96 to 04. So the problem is, on the back, usually you'll have this one coolant line coming from the head and it'll flow up and it'll go down into your water pump. And on the other side, there won't be anything here whatsoever. And the coolant will just deadhead right here and sit and not cool that. So you'll get valve tick, get hot spots, all sorts of problems. So the way to fix that is by doing this, which is you go on eBay or you pull it, whatever, buy another one of these, and install on this side with a T that goes into the water pump. So all you gotta do is on this side, there's a freeze plug there, instead of it being a coolant line, and they come out very easily. All you have to do is put a screwdriver right on the edge of one side, hit it a few times hard with a mallet, and the freeze plug will just turn. You can grab it with some pliers and pull it out. And then this fits right in. Now there are narrow holes made to hold this in place since it doesn't belong originally. So you'll have to drill a hole about right in this area that lines up to a mount for the other heater hose. So you drill a little hole through there, get the same bolt from the other side, put it in here. You want to put the heater hose mounting over top of those to make it sort of seals. So you install this heater hose, put the bolt in, and then you just gotta run your lines. And what I did was got some 5 8 heater hose, which is about the size, size it is, and 5 8 T. Ran that little curve up, did the T right here, a couple hose clamps, a bunch of RTV. It goes over to that side. Up top, that's where it tees off goes over to the original spot on that goes down to your water pump that way it will flow semi evenly from both this head and that head it will have much better cooling so that's one way of doing it, there's a couple other ways to do it but from what I've researched and asked around this seems to be the best way to do it to get the best cooling All right, this is the finished product. What you do is you have all the coolant come out of the head. You use the stock hose to go into the heater like it usually does. Then you use the other curved one, cut it a little bit, it comes out, goes to the T. Your other head over there, that coolant's gonna come across. T up and go down into your line that goes through to your water pump. So it's pretty close to your stock here, just you tee another one, cut this one a little shorter to get it so it pulls from both sides.